well, what consent are we getting from fantasy versus NFL.com versus from the Giants? And then add on top of that, that every club and, or, and league product has a mobile app. Uh, there's uh, CTV streaming apps, um, and all of them have, have a bit of a fragmented ecosystem. And then I think at the NFL, at least, we're slightly unique here, about like 80% of our data actually comes in through third-party platforms. So we're thinking about ticketing partners, um, NFL shop through Fanatics, um, any one of our uh, other sponsors and partner organizations, whether it's media or not. So if you go and play Madden, you might get presented with uh, consent to sh receive marketing from the NFL. If you watch uh, games on Peacock streaming, you might be presented with a consent to share information with the NFL. Um, so you have all these flags coming in from all these different places. So your real first exercise is standardizing that process and making sure that you can ingest it in a way that makes sense and get back to one true central understanding of what what is this person's status? Is Joe going to receive marketing or not across all these platforms? Has he opted out? Has he opted in? What has he actually consented to? What notice has he seen? Um, and that without doing that exercise and going through like implementation that we've done with one trust um, you can't get to the preference center execution where you get into the more sexy elements of high degree of control